cornfields and a tractor? Now what could be more American than that? Hi, my name is Sarah Walters, your host of the American Dream and Remax Realtor. Today I would like to welcome you to Waterloo, Wisconsin, and we're going to be stopping by Humbleton Brewery. They actually make their own beer from start to finish. They even grow their own hops. So come on along, because there's a lot to do in Waterloo. So today I am doing something that I have never done before. I'm in a hops field where they actually grow the hops to make the beer. And I'm joined by Mike from Humbleton Brewery, mm -hmm. where they make the beer from start to finish. Mike, thanks for joining us here today. Yeah, of course, of course. So we are here at a hops plant. Mm -hmm. Can you tell me a little bit about this? Yeah, definitely. So Wisconsin used to actually grow a large, large volume of them. They were one of the biggest producers in the nation for many years. Great. So these are green and uh, when, when are they ready to harvest? So these are kind of like pine cones. If you notice, uh, some of them are really tight on here. The, the blades are coming down really tight. Yeah. When they're ready to harvest, it'll start to fan out and you can actually see the yellow resin called lupulin inside of it. And that's about when you know it's ready to harvest. And we figured, you know what, if we're gonna do it right, let's make it quality. Let's do it as good as we can, really take care of them and babysit them and make sure they're growing as well as they can. Well, they, they're stunning plants and this is a great location. Let's go up and, and check out the brewery. Yeah, definitely. Okay, so we are in the brewery where they make the actual beer and we're standing in front of these gigantic silver tanks. Can you tell me how these are used in the process and what they're used for? Yeah, definitely. So these are our 10 barrel larger scale fermenters. So when we make larger batches of beer, like our year round beers and things that we produce very consistently, this is where we put them so we can make more beer more efficiently. So we are here, we've made it. We're at your new location, the tap room. Uh, what do you think makes this location different than your other location? So we've got a full kitchen down here instead. We've got a lot more green space to work with. We've got sand volleyball courts, live music, horseshoes. We got a lot more activities going on down here. So this is the place to be if you want a belly full of food. Wow, super fun. So you got food, you got music, you got dancing, you have it all. Yeah, definitely. What more could you ask for? <laughs> Not much. <laughs> Hamilton Brewery, great place, great people, but now it's time to go check out one of my new listings. Come on. This stunning country home has it all. The custom kitchen has countertops that are both quartz and granite, and it opens up into this lovely dining area. And who wouldn't want to sit next to that cozy fireplace in the middle of a Wisconsin cold winter? The home has three bedrooms, two baths, and a walkout basement. And just what every country home needs, a barn. This steel barn was built just last year and it's a perfect size to store all your toys. Thanks for joining us. We'll catch you next time on the American Dream.